you talk, talk, talking, but I'm still not hearing any answers. Why didn't you tell me you was having lunch with him? You know how I feel about Trey. He called at the last minute. I can't always tell you every little thing that pops up in my day. You should have told him that. <laughs> Derwin, Oprah's going to be on the view. Smiley face. <laughs> Derwin, how do you turn on the DVD again? Derwin, I feel fat. Sad face. <laughs> told you tonight yeah tonight would have been too late for me to tell you i don't want you having lunch with him why are you freaking out you know we're just friends melanie that naivete is normally very cute but right now not so much <laughs> men don't want to just be friends with beautiful women come on Derwin. trey's not thinking about me like that no please there were plenty of times he could have made a move on me but he didn't never not once you mean to tell me he never gave you the smoky bedroom eye no. <laughs> Never hugged you a bit too long. Never. After you needed a back rub. No. Well, see, I knew it. What? Friends get back rubs. You've given back rubs. Yeah, to every girl I want to sleep with, including you. Mm. Oh, really? And exactly how many back rubs were you giving out? Plenty. And I haven't had chimichangas with any of them since we started going out. Back in your court. Mm. Derwin, Trey and I are like family. His mother considers me the daughter she's never had. And even if in some crazy paranormal world he was interested in me, it wouldn't matter. I don't want him. I love you. Wait a minute. Don't be trying to smooth me out when you love me. Mm. Why not? That's what you do when I bring up... Mel, don't you say her name. Dion. Dion, Dion, Dion. Dion is necessary for work. If Trey is just a friend, then you can afford to cut him loose. Again! Melanie has to make all the sacrifices. Hey! It's embarrassing enough he got drafted 60 spots ahead of me. Now when I face him on the field, all I'm going to be thinking about is you yucking it up with him at the taco joint. <laughs> and while I'm out there thinking, I take a bad hit and end up paralyzed. Damn! Now if you'd... If you'd rather change my diaper than to give up your friendship, then... I don't know what to say about you. I can't believe this. All you need to believe is that you ain't never gonna see Trey Wiggs again. Damn. Now, I don't think she sh should have had to give her friendship up, but she should have told him she was going to eat with him prior. Band-aid, a declaration. You know what? I can even text it to you. Melanie, keep your ass away from Trey.